Right, hello again dear viewers. James Braithwaite here, yet again. This time, um, again, sowing, sowing the seeds of love. Well, the seeds of garden plants, anyway. Yeah. Okay. Now, I've got this little propagator from Lidl. Um, and it, it was a really good deal, actually. I got it from a got it for a five and uh, it came with some herbs but I'm using the uh, herb seeds for uh, a later project and uh, I'm using uh, this to uh, grow some really nice little flowers. I'm using the uh, sewing and cutting compost as before. So, if we see here, that's what you should have. And uh, we'll just do some dipping. By which, uh, it's just very, a, a sort of very small way of uh, planting seed, but uh, a very small version of planting seed potatoes. You might even see our local robin if you uh, if you're lucky. They always come round when you're gardening. They love it when you you know disturb things that uh, they might like. There he is. Oh, they all come onto the table. There's more than one. Okay. This is a Lichnis Ragged Robin, which is fitting enough, I suppose. I'm going to do six little, six little tubs of these. Really nice. Uh, these, I mean, majors are really popular with uh, pollinators. Wonderful cottage plants. You want, you want, fl uh, you want uh, bees and butterflies in uh, in your garden? Then look no further. These are.
really close there. Sorry, that's my phone flashing. And finally, for the last two places, this is a trifolium, which uh, is uh, another nice looking little thing. This will probably. Uh, Administering medicine. The uh, trouble with bending over like this, do you? Is it doesn't have to do your back sometimes. You have to be careful. It's a blackbird. female blackbird nesting. <laughs> mm. I wish I could just swip everything round and show you. But... Mm. The great thing about a propagator is it's uh, essentially a miniature greenhouse, so it'll uh, it'll really get them going. Okay, and there she is, all ready to go. I will see you in the next one. Hello, for now.